Hey guys, and welcome back. Today is Thursday, January 31st, 2019. That's right. It's uh, the last day of the month. We got one month down. We got uh, 11 more to go. All right. Well, today I got to walk down to El Centro again. I got to go pick up some blunts. I got to go pick up a few little things at the store. So I decided to bring the camera with me yet again and uh, just walk and talk for a little while. And uh, it's a fucking beautiful day out. It's 82 degrees out. It's fucking beautiful. It's fucking uh, it's paradise out here. So right now we are on Calle 60. And we're gonna be walking all, all the way down, all the way up, uh, down Calle 60, and then eventually we'll be walking back. But, uh, yeah, so I wanna show you guys um, what Calle 60 is all about. So, here on Calle 60, there's like a lot of stuff, you know what I mean? Like, it's, uh, there's a lot of like things. So, for example, you know what? I'm gonna strap you to my head so I can continue talking. It'll make it a lot easier. One second, guys. But for example, look, there's art galleries. You see? So for example, there's an art gallery right there, as you can see. And there's gonna be more of these as we walk along. See, all right. Make sure I don't look that fucking crazy. Okay, horrible. All right, let's try it again. And I should do this beforehand, right? But I think you guys enjoy the craziness. All right, there we go. Okay, so as you can see, you're looking at a gallery right here. A lot of Mexican stuff, you see? You got another gallery right there. Here, make sure we're on straight. We're on straight. Okay, how's it going? Another beautiful gallery right here. How's it going? <laughs> and uh, a little corner of the store. And again, we're just a few blocks from my house. That's it. Like literally two blocks from my house. So now we're going to continue walking. All right. Makes this guy is uh, not letting me in front. He's in a hurry. So this is all prime real estate, guys. A lot of times when I want to go on a date with a girl for the first time, I go to the park we're going to go see right now. But uh, but yeah, so like this area right now is becoming genderified. And as you can see, there's like a little store there that sells like antiques and stuff, I think. I don't know what they sell there. Um, but again, all, all these little places here, all these little spots are being bought up, okay? They're being bought up or they're being rented out or what have you. And... Um, yeah, as you guys can see, this is like uh, Soho, I guess, you know? Like, um, I don't know what to say, but you feel me. It's like the little art district. There you go. That's what it is. It's like the little um, Merida art district. So uh, here's like a shoe store that sells shoes. Um, there's other stuff. Contemporary art. LA, it's like La Sala. It's like La Sala art design. So you see? I don't know if you guys can see there. Nice art. So there's all kinds of shit here, you know what I mean? Like, if you're an artist, if you're, um, if you want to open up a gallery, um, see, I'm looking at that sign because I, I dated a girl that made signs just like that here. Don't leave it at that. Anyways, um, I'm horrible. Look, another art gallery, you see? Hopefully you guys can see there, it looks beautiful, it looks awesome. I don't want to walk in here with this. A lot of times walking in with a camera is not like a good thing. So uh, we got a little store there, this is a church. I think there's like an American library around here. 
like around here or around here i don't know where but there's like a an american library so there's that i want to go that way so i can show you that for a minute i'm just waiting for this guy to make up his fucking mind come on dude all right as you see you don't need traffic cops you don't need anything people can just figure it out or else chapa so uh yeah usually this is open I, I, they, that it's not in service now i guess but they usually have this open all open at nighttime if you come here later tonight this is open it's church this is uh fucking mexico bro people love church look at okay so yeah i forgot to show you so over there there's like a like a fancy restaurant another art gallery another art gallery whatever the fuck that is in here there was a rock concert once i remember i remember walking in there and there was like this huge concert art gallery stuff space and as you guys can see you know like everything is just in the process of being rebuilt being re whatever let me just show you over here and so this park is usually just a park but right now um as you guys can see they're setting up because uh they're having a, a festival de oaxaca so by the way great food i already went out there but hopefully you guys can see there's like all this food over there you eat here look at all these goodies so this is not stuff from Merida. this is all from oaxaca which is another part of mexico So they got all kinds of awesome stuff here. Look at that. Hola, buenos días. And so usually this park right here, so usually as you guys can see, like this park is just a park. So they have like a fountain going on, they got you know, little chairs, little everything. So it's like a cool little park. People gather here for all kinds of shit. I come out here for my dates all the time because it's close to the house. I meet them here, hang out here, and we take it from there. And again, like you see, like the whole park is being surrounded by Oaxaca. You see, look. My good friend from, uh, my good Mexican friend from Seattle was from Oaxaca. And he used to always tell me about Oaxaca. So anyways, so like there's a Oaxacan festival here. So we're doing that. Mexican so we got jewelry we got all kinds of stuff I thought this festival was already over I didn't know that this festival was still going on today this might be one of the last days if not the last day um, but yeah it's just awesome beautiful stuff so all this stuff is like juices or ice cream or something I think it's ice cream. Yeah, look, there you go. Some sort of frozen dessert. Oaxacan ice cream. Silver. I don't know if you guys are heard. There's a lot of silver out here. Pure. See, look. Even the jewelry out here is pure silver, bro. You know, they're not fucking with you and no fake shit. And, um, yeah, more stuff. And then uh, let's go through here. I gotta go that way, but fuck it, I'm already here. Look at this, all, this, uh, all these candies and confections from Mexico. All kinds of cool stuff. And then, then you know, this is just, uh, today is Wednesday afternoon, literally Wednesday on a two o'clock in the afternoon. Hola. Um, and yeah, see, look, there's like food here. I guess they're making some tortillas or something. You got clothes. You got candy and stuff. I guess that's still mixed with your coffee. Hold on. <laughs> you got leather goods, wallets, food, confections, more stuff. I guess juice stuff. <laughs> so yeah, let's just keep let's just take a little walk through here real quick. As you guys can see, look toys. All kinds of really cool stuff. 
Everything made by hand, made out of wood. Look at that, some nuts. Beautiful. Look at, look at that. That's some good shit right there. It smells delicious. And that huele delicioso. So um, yeah, that usually, um, I remember back in the States, I used to love um, getting the roasted nuts and all that shit. I got all that roasted pecans, you know, like prol pralines or whatever. So as you can see, there's using a, a, the typical um, copper pot for that. So, all right, look, oh man, we have some good stuff here. These little things, they fill them with like Nutella or whatever you want there. And bro, they're so good. These little things, I don't know what the hell they're called, but. I had them here the other day with uh, the girl that I'm seeing. Phenomenal, phenomenal. You got clothes, typical stuff. Seat shells, ooh, what are this? Oh, cool, that's like the stuff from the shells to to make the creams. Hola, mucho gusto. Hola. Hola. We got more stuff over here. We got more breads and goods. There's a lot of flies around here. Shit. <laughs> good stuff. Good stuff. All right. So let's just walk. All right. So you guys can take and get an idea. So, okay. So look over here. This area right here. This is where I come to eat a lot. This is one of my favorite restaurants. This area right here. Oh, no. Um, but yeah, so like, um, I like coming here to eat. Um, this is Parque Santana. Parque Santa Ana. It's one of my favorite places to come. Obviously, you see there's always stuff going on. Usually, this is packed with food and people. Um, the tourists all come through here. It's uh, great stuff. Um, and so, yeah, so now we're going to walk this way. I'm going to walk this way, so I'm going to show you guys a little bit on this side. But yeah, you can do some more festival stuff there. You can park your car here. Um, Paseo Montejo's right there. That's like the, the end. That's like the little roundabout. So Paseo Montejo ends right here. Paseo Montejo ends over there at the end where that tree is, where that statue is. That's Paseo Montejo. It ends there. And it, I mean, and that ends. It starts, ends, whatever. And it goes all the way to the fucking north of the city. So from there, all the way up. So we're just, we were walking parallel. That's that way. And uh, hopefully you guys can see that. Traffic. Let me see if I can cross right here without getting killed. And then, you know, we just have all kinds of stuff here. So there's just like a typical convenience store that sells beer, sells everything. Um, there's a little coffee shop. Pretty good coffee, actually. Not that bad. I used to come here. Um, here, more smoking accessories. Blunts are expensive here, and they don't have the variety I got. I like, but hey, look, just in case of an emergency, I got blunts now a few steps away. Um, and again, what is this? It's probably like a doctor. I don't even know what the fuck. Like a store. I look like a crazy person with my fucking hair. Look at this. So obviously these guys know what they're doing. See, they make frames for paintings. Oh, what the? Because as you can see, we already we passed all these galleries, and all these galleries are going to be needing in, of frames for their paintings. So bam, these guys set up shop right in front of them. They ain't stupid. It's just uh, clothes, like a clothes shop or like a tailor. Like a tailor might be a tailor. Yeah, here you can get your clothes made. There's a paint shop because all this shit's being developed. So why not open up a paint shop? You know what I mean? So why not open up a paint shop right across from everything that's going to need painting? You feel me? Sorry, so we're going to cross the street. Get over here. All right. So a little detour there. A little fucking detour. So now we're walking back towards El Centro, all right? And uh, that was just a little detour. Um, sometimes it happens, you know? Uh, you get like a little festival, a little what have you. So look at this. The, the, this is where all the bottles come to die. So. I think that's over there for, um, this will be like um, children and families back in the States. So you come here and it's like WIC. So here, you know, families that 
you know they have like the special uh, food stamp card or whatever the fuck they come here to get you know cheap food and all this other stuff all right one second i gotta fix the camera Oof. Yeah, hey, sorry about that. I was just getting hot and I was like sweating and shit. So I was just uh, wanted to make sure the camera doesn't get all wet. But anyways, as you guys can see, you know, people go in there with their family, their children's, all that, all that good stuff. And that's all this is, you know? That's pretty cool. So, you know, that's where you go there to get, um, I guess, like food stamp type stuff. Or other stuff. I mean, you know, I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I, that's what I think it is. I could be 100% wrong. This is probably just like a regular place for people. There's like a look. This is like a lending tree, like a place you get monies and loans and shit. Um, you got a pizza right there. I heard that's a really good pizza. I heard it's really good pizza there. And then that's like, I, I don't know, I haven't been to that place, but it looks good. It, it looks like it's a, it might be a good place to go. So we are, guys, we're just walking around Merida today. We're celebrating 1,000 subscribers. I've, I've uh, made it over 1,000 fucking subscribers. Isn't that fucking crazy? Ain't that cray cray? It's like some hotel or what have you so as you guys can see things are not like necessarily as polished yet but it's like man you know you, you can already see you can already feel you already know that this place is gonna be popping it's already popping it's already popping but uh, man I'm telling you look you're gonna be hanging yourself later You're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna be kicking yourself and hanging yourself for not coming out here earlier or sooner. So there's like some shop or some sort of plaza, you know. So, yeah, we're just celebrating a thousand subscribers. We're just walking around uh, Mexico, hanging out, just chilling like a bunch of villains. There's like, um, I mean, there's news to talk about, but just news that I feel like we've already been talking. And uh, all right, now it's gonna start getting a little noisy out here. Look at that, a gastro bar. You already know this shit ain't fucking from here. But this this place must be good as fuck though. They got Spanish fucking shit out there. This shit's probably bomb. But yeah. Let's uh, go this way. We got another restaurant, bar, whatever the fuck this place is. And, and you can tell, you know, you can tell. This looks like any other place back home. This looks like any other place in, in, in Canada, in Europe, in the United States. As you guys can see. So this, like I said, you know, this, everything's already getting genderified, you know? Got another hostel right there. I didn't even know there was a hostel there. We got a, a clothing store. We got a gelato shop. Gelato, man. Once you went, once you see a gelato shop, you already know what's up. Oh, by the way, this place right here. Oh, you can't see the sign, but look, this place right here. Is, um, is is it's it's hard to explain. I wish you could see more, but 
so what it is is like it's a bunch of like little restaurants it's kind of like a giant food court but it's all like really fancy restaurants and really good food and then uh yeah you know um you just walk you go in there and then you just order your food and you sit around and you have like really really good food so that's that's that place it's a shame i wish i could show you more but it's only open at night it's only like one of those things that's open at night and stuff so uh what else what else we got to talk about let me see got some selling some restaurant equipment there if you want any restaurant equipment that's how you can tell the locals from the non-locals the locals smile the non-locals do not smile righty I think that guy was getting a shoe shine. There's a shoe shine guy. So we're gonna be walking through. Yeah, I'll show you guys. Alright, okay. Yeah, so that big that big central park. The big central park that I show you guys a lot um, is head is this way, but we're gonna come we're coming in at another angle. We're coming in from another angle. They got a steakhouse. Oh look at this place. Okay, so this place, I forgot the name of this park. But as you guys can see, this is a touristy, touristy. You see we got like a deli. You guys can see very tourist friendly here so here you'll find like steaks and like you know just tourist friendly stuff you know what i mean this is a tourist haven <laughs> so you know this is the place you you you, you and there's good food here but the air the thing about this area is that you're gonna be spending a lot of fucking money you know what i mean when you know if you if you usually like when you land here this is one of the first places you might come and you're the prices are still gonna be cheap don't get me wrong the prices will be cheap but when you go to the through the rest of mexico and you realize oh wait a minute you know this is the tourist trap you're like oh shit okay and so that's the thing you know so everything here is good it's great you know they got like a uh, stage for doing stuff they got a lot of touristy shit here um all these restaurants are you know fucking top notch you know five star ish you know the typical mexican might not be able to afford them but uh that's the thing too that you get to come to a place like this here and it's fucking affordable prices it's like uh like chili's prices or whatever and uh and that's the difference but this is a, it's a good spot usually around here like a lot of people set up shop in this little area here and there's like little stores there's people laying shit on the ground selling stuff selling artwork selling all kinds of stuff so this little plaza gets full um there's stuff on this side all this looks kind of full um there's like a giant representation of uh these things as you guys can see you see they're everywhere you got people selling stuff there and so we're gonna keep walking we keep walking and talking oh remember so there's a bunch of good restaurants down this street here too like really good restaurants good restaurants good stuff around here little store little corner shop um we got guayaberas for sale here everywhere this is 100% Cuban, by the way. Guayaveras are 100% Cuban. Those are the shirts, special shirts. So you can see there's a restaurant here. Uh, very American friendly stuff, tourist stuff. So yeah, we're just uh, hanging around. So yeah, I'm not even gonna lie. I was, today's episode, I was gonna talk about I was gonna talk about a bunch of stuff today. You know, we got Litecoin, we got, you know, a thousand subscribers. We got like all this news, Venezuela, you name it. Bunch of shit to talk about. But, I, you know, a lot of times when I put the camera on, I get distracted and I'm just talking to you about everything else. Oh, look, a UPS store. All right, So, and that's what we're doing today. We're just hanging out. See, look at that, they're building something there. 
beautiful whatever this is and so we're just walking around and i'm just showing you around and we're just hanging out hanging out with jose so you know this like you know rent the car tourist shit clothes another hotel bus bus supposed to be a really good restaurant again uh, gendermified shit um i think this is like the cathedral like a major cathedral or that's a cathedral i don't know we're walking this way anyway another restaurant here so here yeah this is like some sort of government uh i mean a government no fucking uh um, you know what hold on let's just walk in there Oh, okay, okay. Um, um, how is the name? Caminando, no? The tourist. Pimbo. Yeah? Okay, thank Gracias. Alright, cool. So I've never actually been in here because there's always something going on, some sort of uh, something. Always weird man like uh the the, the non-locals are the, always the ones that give me it looks like a library in there that's cool just take a little walk around I guess it's like a well or something. I don't want to stick my head down there. I might fall in the well. Cool. I think it's like a government building, I want to say. Oh, it's a university. Okay. That's what this place is. Okay. That's cool. I'll come on another time. <laughs> see, see. So yeah, we're just hanging out. I guess we can go up there, but I'm good. It gave me another reason to come back. So yeah, it's a university. Cool. All right. First time I've ever been in there. So, and then there, you know, let me see if I can cross real quick. Hold on. So over here, so look, we were just in there, in that building, and now we're in here. There's a building across. You see? I think, oh, this is the, uh, hey, how's it going? Yeah, this is uh, the theater, the major theater, the, the concert hall, or some shit like that. The theater. So this is like the theater theater. So when you're gonna come do like, um, like Broadway or whatever the fuck, like theater stuff, this is it. So I guess you go here. Cool, yeah, they buy your tickets there. You buy your tickets for the, the theater. The restaurant. Look at that. You know what, maybe I'm gonna take this. So this is the symphony. Oh look, the, my neighbor, my neighbor plays here. So this is where my neighbor plays. Look at that. My neighbor might be one of these guys. Or not, but whatever. Cool. Look at that. 
Alrighty, so I'm gonna take that for dates, you know? This is for like the advanced date, okay? But if I'm, if I'm taking, if uh, we're coming to the fucking, all right, let's cross over here. If, I, if I'm taking her to the symphony, it's an advanced date, okay? Remember, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a meet at the park, buy some coffee kind of guy, that's it. So, so here is like another little park. Oh, here's another theater, university, look. So here's like uh, like another little park. At nighttime, there's a bunch of shit that gathers here. So at nighttime, you know, there's like a bunch of people selling stuff, selling artwork, selling um, little jewelry, uh, knickknacks, um, all kinds of everything. So that's what happens here at night. And throughout this whole area here, we got another cathedral right there. Um, just tourist shit out here restaurant bar a lot of these things are closed now they open up later at night it's still early it's still early so see look ladies night today <laughs> it's like it's probably, it's probably, it seems like they haven't moved this shit in a long time I, i'm guessing this is every night um but yeah just so you can kind of get the vibe out here a little different so See, these prices are a bit expensive, you know, because you can get a lot of this stuff for way cheaper. Just at that place I told you, oh, was at the beginning of the episode, and I was showing you, oh, these, you know, this is like my favorite place to eat. It's a lot cheaper for, for shit like that. That's way too expensive. Way too expensive. And shit like that. But whatever, it's all good, though. This is, again, right in the middle, right in the heart of the city, of the touristy, of the friendly touristy area. This is a friendly, very friendly, everything's friendly here. But... There's a touristy area. Like 100 zillion percent. That's Burger King. Burger King, you can see people eating burgers in the Burger King. That's a very... That, that, that park as well fills up with people. Look how beautiful. See, look, these places have already been painted and so on and so forth. But look how beautiful everything already looks. How awesome it looks. Just waiting for the cross the street but anyway so this park as you can see there's already people there selling stuff making artwork doing all kinds of shit um it's like a little plaza people gather anyway this is the first restaurant i ever ate in the first restaurant i ever came to eat in right here really good stuff i've been here several times i was here with my friends and they were throwing beans at him because he was a tourist i think it was for another reason but whatever um but it's a good restaurant they're, they're all over the place it's like a chain they're everywhere Another bar, very typical. It's very American here, as you guys can see. So, oh look, this guy, he, he comes through my house all the time. He comes through my neighborhood. So he's advertising shit. He's, adverti he's advertising uh, the thing in, in my park. See? See the Oaxaca festival. See? So here you buy stuff, you can buy a motorbike, get stuff. Nice park here, people selling stuff. But as you guys can see the park here, um, there's a Starbucks here somewhere. The fuck is there it is? There's a Starbucks. There's another theater over there. There's a lot of theater, a lot of art, a lot of awesomeness here. This is a typical Starbucks, as you guys already know. Another hotel, another hotel. Very tourist friendly here. You know, um, yeah. And I gotta walk the other way. That's why I'm not walking too far this way, but yeah, you guys can figure it out. Let's see what we got. All right. I hate backtracking. I hate backtracking. That, that's bad bad filming right here. Bad filming. I'm backtracking. All right, all right. Sorry. And right, let's get back. You know what? Let's uh, cross the street. So look how beautiful these buildings are. Look, there's archaeological shit here. 
another whatever they're building here oh look hold on it's like it's like a hotel i'm not quite sure the theater another theater how many theaters have we seen there's like for like 10 theaters that we've already not 10 but like one two three four like five theaters five theaters in this little area right here and uh but yeah look at just uh look at the colors look how the beauty over there look you see like a bunch of geode stuff and rocks and archaeological stuff all this stuff that's probably found around here um literally because this place is full of all that stuff so they have all that shit there they have <laughs> and so um but look at the colors too you know once they you know um fix up the place you know what i mean like remember i told you uh just paint just give it a new paint job look at this shit look out look at awesome Look how everything pops as opposed to this side. You feel me? Big difference. And uh, yeah, just a Wednesday afternoon. Wednesday afternoon, hanging out. And so look, this is like the major cathedral. Right now, as you guys can see, we're, the center is right there. That's if you guys know, if you guys already know the city and where we're at, you guys already know where we're at. So this is the major like old school cathedral that's been here a million years. I walk through here all the time um, but yeah you can see like the cathedral like I walked through that area I'm sorry I'm on, I'm on the wrong side here but um, is it the bank over there I gotta go to the bank I'll go to the bank over there but we're almost done with the broadcast today guys but I think you know I want to make sure I don't get run over but as you guys can see you know this is where all, all everything's always going on here you know whether it's tourists the locals um, everybody's always hanging out here. There's always something to do, even if you're just gonna hang out at the park for a little bit. Um, you guys already see the little horses. You know, you guys want to go on a horsey ride. This is where I rescued. I rescued Lambo from here. He's one of these horses. So, but yeah. So as you guys can see, anyone can just set up shop whenever they want. They're doing shoe shines on that end. I think he's doing the same thing over there. Um, the sun is fucking bright. It's hot as fuck right now. I gotta go to a few stores in this area, so I gotta about to let you guys go. But you see, look, this is uh, all the pigeons are hanging out there. The sun is right over my fucking head. It's like one o'clock, two o'clock in the afternoon right now. So I usually see now I'm kind of lost because I forgot. So I, I I'm gotta go that way. So I gotta go that way. But I usually come down there. I come down this way. So I usually come down that street. We're in the square right now. We're in the middle of the fucking square. All right, hold on. Let's do this right. All right, so I, I usually, all right, right here, we're in the middle of the fucking city, literally. I'm in the middle of the fucking city right now, literally. So there's the church that I'm always showing you guys. There's the fucking flag all the way up there. No chemtrails today. Um, so usually I walk, this is the north. I usually walk down that street, down through there, all the way down that way. There's like art stuff that way. I walk down this street today. Look at all these birds. Look at this. Cool, right? Let me show one of them hit me. Ah, oh, shit. There's a lot of them. <laughs> oh, man, I wonder how that's going to come out. That might be a cool effect. Awesome. All right. So, <laughs> I'm, I'm telling you, man. You see, you got to take one for the team, man. Always. All right. So, and I usually walk down. Now, I mean, I was walking down this street. We're going to continue going down that way. And there's like another art gallery thing there. Man, it was one of these motherfuckers hitting me in the head. <laughs> oh shit, that was a close one. <laughs> Alrighty. I don't think the birds like me filming them, but whatever. It's not my, it's not my problem. So. And then, yeah, just like all the touristy stuff here, all the regular stuff. The more touristy stuff on this end than on that end, more locals on that end, whatever. And that's it guys i think we're gonna be ending it here soon we got like ice cream shops all kinds of stuff here bus there's a regular bus taking people to whatever we got jewelry shop we got all kinds of shops all kinds of awesome goodiness and 
awesome cool stuff and uh, I think that's it guys I gotta get going because I gotta go that way I think I'm gonna end it here all right so we gotta all right guys so literally as I was pulling this thing off my head the camera shut down because it was too hot you already know it's my head it had nothing to do with the Sun but regardless uh, thank you so much for joining me today don't forget to please like please subscribe please share I hope you enjoyed taking a walk with me through at Centro once again um, we took a different route this time as we usually always do I don't want to keep boring you with the same shit and uh, we just talked about the city a little bit today so that's all we did today um, yeah thanks again for watching and I'll see you guys later tonight later later today whatever the usual and uh, peace thanks again though hey guys how's it going I'm home um, it's like five something o'clock in the afternoon I literally got home a little while ago I don't even want to record this or talk about this or anything but i'll tell you guys straight up what happened to me so yeah after i turned the camera off a little while ago um i went to the bank i had to do a couple things but yeah long story long when i went to the bank and i went to use my bitpay card it fucking ate my bitpay card and that is the only lifeline that i have out here so that happened to me and now i don't have a bitpay card and so now i'm trying to figure out um a way in which to um facilitate that um i spent hours you know calling people the bank the this or that and trying to figure everything out and this is one of the things that sucks about being out here it's not all rosy and cheeky and, and, and awesome sometimes shit sucks and and then when you have all your stuff on the other end and it's, it's 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 a pain in the ass so but regardless i've been able to come up with a bunch of solutions thank god if you would have seen me a little while ago i was really freaking out and not having a good time and it was a shitty afternoon but now it's just a shitty aftermath to all this. And uh, and it's just, you know, um, it's it's difficult. The, the whole banking system, the banking cartel, the central banks, everything, all the whole, the whole system makes it very, very difficult and uncomfortable and hard to deal with things. And, uh, you know, maybe this is the kick in the butt I need to really start setting up some sort of uh, Bitcoin cryptocurrency exchange out here or, or something. Um, but I, I'm, you know, I, like I said, you know, thank God I was able to figure out and find some solutions and I'm, I'm working on that right now. But, uh, yeah, it, it hasn't been easy. I'll tell you that. And this is another one of the non easy situations I'm dealing with out here. So guys, all I'm asking you is to send a lot of positive energy, a lot of love, a lot of, uh, optimism, a lot of everything. And, uh, hopefully everything will be okay. I think everything will be okay. Everything seems to be going okay. will be okay. But uh, yeah, you know, don't don't think it's easy for me out here, man. It is a grind in all aspects. And then even when something like this happens, which is a technically an easy solution back in the States or anywhere else, it isn't when you're over here and you're abroad and uh, there's just so many hoops to jump through and so on and so forth. So anyways, guys, sorry to end it on a som such a somber mood. But again, things are great. Things are awesome. I'm happy to be here. I'm happy to have you guys here and so on and so forth. And uh what can I do? All I can do is, uh, rec you know, finish editing, actually edit this video and upload this video and uh, call it a day and uh, not, to, not try to try not to go too crazy. And uh, and just thank God that I have you guys out there because it's been a weird, bittersweet day. I'll tell you that right now. But again, I, I just thank God and the heavens and thank that I'm here that I'm able to live this life, do these things, have these problems and so on and so forth and that things could be worse. And as a matter of fact, they're actually pretty good. And uh, it's just nothing, you know, sometimes it's just the way it is, you know, what are you going to do? Life sometimes gives you lemons and when you when they give you lemons, you got to make some really badass lemonade. So guys, I got to let you go because I got to make me some frozen lemonade with some fucking vodka and the whole nine. Thanks again for watching. Don't forget to please like, please subscribe, please share. And just thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for being on this journey with me all throughout the good, the bad, and the ugly. All right, guys. Love you. Peace. And I'll see you guys Friday, tomorrow. Thank you.